today. And a couple of guys are on a lift. So I guess this taller structure you see here is going to be that Cineplex movie theater. And when Los Angeles can have movie theaters open, that's, that's gonna be a pretty uh, significant day. Cause that's, that's been a major problem in this county as far as not being open for quite some time, but that's the plan. One of the announced businesses that will be here, according to our rendering, it would be on the corner here of Century and Prairie. And also, according to that rendering, you'd have two, it looks like video screens that'll be mounted, one over here and then another facing the uh, Prairie Avenue side. that uh, sheathing backing kind of a weather panel hopefully uh, see some finished exteriors here in the next maybe couple of months I'm hoping okay we're off of prairie over by the re residential up here in Airhorn so we got that going up some small little beam See that other tower crane in the background is not being utilized, but looks like they're going to put some steel structures here up above this wood framing. Well, they already have some. Looks like they got a welder guy there on standby.
see there's some other framing here. Not wood framing, but uh, some kind of metal. Interesting to see how this develops, what it looks like. Looks like it's going to be pretty tall, too. You can see some of that metal work from the top to ground level. Okay, and the tower crane is operational. You can see it's got a load of, I think it's lumber. Yeah. Swinging to the right. Swings pretty quick. That's a uh, parking garage below the residential. To take their mojo away from the downtown Hoop Dojo. Some of the usual suspects up on the roof. I'm really curious what kind of maintenance is required up there, especially now that the season is over. Um, the next big scheduled event here would be I think in March for a Wrestlemania which I haven't really heard about if that's gonna go on you know presumably without fans of course but I would imagine they could have it an empty venue for that. This landscaping is an enjoying a very nice day in Inglewood. Upper 70s, maybe 80 degrees. Not bad for January. Winter, technically. And you can see over here at the east end of the parking lot, the 5G building. We got the wall up on the most part and then you can see about half of the wall there is painted. Looks like it's about the same color as the uh, roof columns and other parts of the stadium. Maybe next season, 2021 season, we might be able to get some fans out here when things are a little bit more, less chaotic. I think I had read somewhere uh, spring training coming up for baseball. They are going to allow some small pods of tickets to be purchased, I believe, um, with social distancing, of course, six, six feet per person. $10 to park here. I mean, nothing's actually open, but that's kind of weird. Some kind of a test uh, 
kind of a test message here. I'll tell you the price, probably per venue, they up it for more important stuff. And then they tell you uh, availability, how many, I guess they have sensors to uh, detect how many cars would be parked in a parking lot per uh, lot.